All right, hello everyone, and happy new year to you all. And how are we all doing today? I know 2020 had been a crazy year, but hopefully things will start to get a little better. Though, by the time you're watching this, you'll have a better idea of whether it looks like it's going to be better or not. Anyway, felt I needed to do a proper opening for this game that I didn't do the first time around, especially with how big this project is. It is not only the first ever fan voted LP as voted on by you, my fine friends, but it is also my present to you for the new year, and on top of the Christmas one that I had already given you, so suffice to say, I spoil you all. But I do love you crazy bastards, and I love giving you guys content. And not only are we giving you this LP as a present at the start of the year, but we're giving it to you three days a week. Say what now? On top of everything else we have going on so far, up to six episodes a week currently, we are now upping the ante to nine new episodes of content weekly, at least for the time that I'm bringing you Red Dead, because I can't keep this up on a regular basis, I'd probably be dead if I even tried. So, anyway, Happy New Year to you all, hope you enjoy the new show, and hope you all have a good year. Wait, yeah, we're playing Red Dead Redemption on the Xbox One, so this console finally getting a little bit of love, and I'm just gonna do normal. I should probably also turn that down a little, shouldn't I? Red Dead single player save could not be found. Of course it couldn't be found, I've never played this game. Yeah, this is another blind one. Also, don't know what game uses an auto save feature. Yeah, that's fine. Link all my bullshit. Yep. <clears throat> mm. But yeah, after a million and a half updates, I finally get to play this damn game. Also, gonna try. Since I know my audio is fine and all, and... Hmm. I would say I should turn this down. I don't know. But I know nothing about this game other than it's the Old West. And it's kind of the spiritual sequel to Red Dead Revolver, which was... Eh, I liked it at the time, but I haven't played it since it came out. <clears throat> okay, so this must be Old West in... Oh. Wait, was the Old... Was the Old West around at this point? Because... Cars weren't invented until, you know, early 1900s. I would have thought the Old West would be was gone by that point. I'm probably going to look for historical logic here and just horribly get it wrong. Probably. And I get... I, I know that's our character... Do we... <laughs> it's like, do we ever get any dialogue? You're probably thinking, no, and Luca, how about you shut up, too? I know we're supposed to be, like... I think we're supposed to be a criminal? I think we're a criminal who's supposed to hunt down our old gang members. At least, that's what I remember. I've read a little bit about this. I've never played it, though, so it's another full blind playthrough. I love doing... I'll admit, I love doing blind playthroughs for you guys, though, because... Then it just show Because then I have no idea what's to come. Well, I, for one, am grateful, Mrs. Bush, that they are finally bringing civilization to this savage land. I could not agree with you more, my dear. My daddy settled this land, and I know he'll be looking down on us, pleased at how we help the natives. Yes, they've lost their land, but they've gained access to heaven. <laughs> yes, that is one way of looking at it. Also, but I'm... Father, do you mean unless an innocent receives communion, they're destined to go to hell? Uh, it hardly seems fair. What I mean to say, Jenny, 
is that there is a great deal of difference between an innocent and a savage. I never thought of it that way. Yes, they live like animals, but they're happier now. Oh. Wow, Grandpa's kind of a dick. <laughs> sure, they lost their land, but they've gained access Not to everything. Now have motor cars, like, Father, but I heard that like pretty soon we will be able to fly. No, only angels can fly, Jenny. No, no, apparently people can fly. Didn't you hear? Out in Kansas, a man even got a car to fly. <laughs> I hardly think so, Jenny. Now I'm confused as to when this is supposed to be taking place. I mean, I shouldn't a take parent. any historical context. You know, I shouldn't take any of it governor, seriously. Which is why he's so concerned with cleaning up the state. Nate Johns. Yes. His family is nothing but hillbilly trash that came here after the war. I don't want to be judgmental, but this state should not be ruled by such a disgusting family. A family without class. Apparently. The John's family have made a lot of money, and he has a lot of friends in politics. Mrs. Bush, money isn't everything. There are many things that money cannot buy. It seems that money can buy voters, though. You mean like fucking manners like you're lacking? Yeah, Grandma is rude. What you must remember, my dear, is that we have been brought here to spread the word. And the word and civilization, they are the same thing. They are the gifts. It is the opportunity we have. The chance to live I'll admit it's funny how this is kind of overlapping with real life. Each other. Kind of. <clears throat> we'll let you worship in peace. Uh, <clears throat> it, it's so confusing, Father. Sometimes I find it impossible to make the distinction between a loving act and a hateful one. I mean, they often seem to be the same thing. Yes, Jenny, it, it is confusing. But you only have to ask me if you need help. Indeed. Well, here we are, Mrs. Bush. Armadillo. Oh yeah, ask me. I'll be. I won't lie to you at all. This. But this seems like an evil act we're doing. No, not in the slightest. Okay, good. I finally get to play options. Please let there be. Headphones, weird. Subtitles, thank you. I'm sorry, folks. I don't want to turn up the volume super loud to have it bleed into the microphone because I'm not sitting that far away from the TV. So I kind of want subtitles. This way I could... Because I can hear them kind of just fine. Oh, and even days pass in this. Neat. I know this is some kind of open world game that's... I don't know a terrible amount about this. Okay, so I can... Oh, I can crouch. I can jump. Oh, that's how to. Can I just... <laughs> Oops. Sorry. Wait. Oh, I did something. I ran his ass over and got an avatar for it. Neat. Wonder if I'll get into fisticuffs with someone. Also, don't know how much in the way of side quests I'm gonna do. No way of knowing yet. I don't even know what all the achievements are. It's a shame that there's no platinum for me to unlock, but hey, I guess a thousand points will be a thousand points. I'm Jake. Your friends from Blackwater hired me to guide you. Hey, my friends. What do you want me to do there, partner? saddled up and ready out front. Yes, the crazy crotchety old man is our guide. Yes. Just go down. You will anyway. Okay, so can I Okay, that's jump. Why doesn't do shit yet? Whoops. Uh, how do I put this away? Well, here, uh, let's mount up and hit the trail. Like Oh, so why mounts the horse then? Take it easy until we're out of town. Ain't no point in causing a rope. 
Whoops, no, I don't. Yeah, I got a problem with that horse. Oh, spur A spurs the horse on. Okay, like I said, never played this before, so learning all the. Oh, if you hold the A. Ah, there we go. Wait, hold. I think I heard his name. Says he got a telegram from You can hold A to match their speed. I guess it's none of my business. That's right. You ain't very talkative, are you? That nope. I'm galloping the get... dog, Okay, not really worried about the galloping thing. I, I just need to mine. keep with Trust him me. apparently. You better off which not that's know. fine. I had a feeling early stamina bar by the left of your radar. Okay, I'm assuming it's that green bar then. Do I have a health bar though? You don't look much like no black border fella. That's because I <coughs> I'm, I'm, being honest, I'm thinking I this first episode is probably just gonna be uh, pushing the storyline. That's what I'm thinking. Blackboard Maybe the first couple of episodes. Of town with delusions, but Whoops. No, Why didn't I Why did he pull out the gun and zoom in? I yep, didn't even yep. hit the button. I know this controller can be a little fussy at times, but still. A fella told me he was out in Blackwater a few months back and sold I them do give them points for allowing me to maintain speed with a companion, this way I don't have to slow down or speed up with them. I'm actually, I actually like that. Times are changing fast, that's for sure. Okay, so where the hell are we going? So who's this friend you're looking for? Nobody you need to concern yourself with. Never you mind I have no idea where the Mr. hell we're going. I just reckon you might be barking out of not heading for the fort. We'll see when we get there. But I sure as hell ain't sticking around. Fort Mercer ain't no place for an old man like me to be a dawdling around. I guess he knows where it is, but yeah, and I think we're almost there. Yeah, I definitely don't want to go careening off the cliff. That might be a bad thing. I don't know, depends on if the horse's legs don't break. Me you're not much in the mood for John. Let's just enjoy the ride. Well, that's what we're trying to do, old man, but you keep John. Gotta get them, gotta get them city boys. So yeah, I have no idea when this game is supposed to take place, because we saw a car being offloaded off the boat, but the flying still seems to be a pipe train. So, like I said, Damn any coyotes! What a waste of good meat! Almost there, Mr. Marston. Ah, no shit! No, I'm going off course. No, why? Well, then why the fuck did you want me to look at the carcass? Come on! Yeah, I'm a coming. Don't know why the fuck you wanted me to look at the carcass then. What was the point? Okay, so. Here's the old fort. Listen, mister. This here is what's left of Fort Mercer. Some gang rode in and took the place over. Hmm. So I understand. I'm wondering if it's... This is where we part ways, friend. You have yourself a good time. I intend on it, partner. <laughs> I'm wondering if the gang hold up at Fort Mercer might be mine, then. You know what? Oh, okay, I didn't mean to jump the... Okay, apparently I cannot offboard the horse right now. Okay, so what do you want? Yeah, I'm like, can I offboard the horse, please? <laughs> Apparently, we do know these Bill folks. Bill Williamson, come out here right now! Go away now, John. <laughs> Don't make me kill you. Nobody needs to kill anyone, Bill. Isn't that what you've come for, though? <laughs> you must think I was born yesterday. <laughs> like you're here to kill me. I did think I was an idiot. Maybe. That ain't fair, Bill. You were as my brother. I've come to try to save you. 
Oh. Well, we do, look like I do appear to have a problem. Bill, please. They want to kill us all. I can help you. We do have a bit of a problem. You never tried to save me before. You only seemed to save yourself. Because we're not out here to try Bill, and save you, are we? I implore we? you think about this. <laughs> you implore me? <laughs> you implore me. You always were one for fancy words. <laughs> oh. Look, well, things love the are teeth. different I'll admit, now, that's, <laughs> that's a funny touch. Now I'm in charge! No more Dutch! And no more you! Implores. I, I implores you to go back and tell them to send someone just a little bit more impressive next time. Damn. Well... <sighs> oh. <laughs> Poor guy. Okay, we suck. You're a hero. And then we're left for dead, and a vulture magically brings us back to life. No, I have no idea. So then what the hell are you folk doing out here? And why are you dragging my car- my- I- I'm not dead. I can tell you that for a fact. I'm not dead. Trust me, if I was dead, we wouldn't have much of a game now, would we? And this isn't- this isn't Dragon Ball logic here, folks. We can't just die and come back to life. No, we're actually in the real world. Where we can mysteriously get shot and still live. Although I guess they must have, they must not have hit a vital, a vital organ, but wouldn't we have bled out? Depending on where, I don't know where the bullet hit. Well, you're alive. Well, yeah. So, it would seem. so how do you feel? Very confused. I don't know the polite word for it. I do. Stupid is the word we use around here. What were you doing? Being stupid. <sighs> I was doing something stupid. Well, you'll be okay. Are when you sure you now? Die, the doctor said you'd be fine. He got the bullets out a couple days ago. Good. It cost us fifteen dollars. Oh no! I'm sorry, madam. <laughs> you left me there to die. Did you want to die? I mean, was that it? Was that why you went straight out to Fort Mercer and picked a fight with the worst bandit in the county to die, Mr. Er, Mr. Uh, Marston, John Marston. Bonnie McFarlane. Miss Bonnie McFarlane. Ooh. Potential love interest? Maybe, right, McFarlane. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Huh. So what were you doing? Being stupid. And trying... trying to give Mr. Williamson a chance. For old time's sake. You know Bill Williamson? Knew him. Long time ago. Well, what was he like? Dumb. Probably not Just the... Just like you. Yeah, probably not the same guy we Maybe. see now. See my hat? I have. And he's gonna be one of those uh, obsessive people. You have now? you seen my hat? Now I'm gonna take my time and go after him the less kind way. Well, that sounds very fun, Mr. Marston. Quite heroic, just like in those penny dreadfuls my brother used to Basically, do. Basically, I'm wondering if we're Meanwhile, gonna start picking off the gang one by one, one and he'll be the last well, one. If you're feeling better, why not take a ride with me later and help me patrol the perimeter? You can earn back some of that money we wasted on doctor's bills. Of course. <laughs> you mean Thank some you. of that fifteen dollars you wasted? My, my, my how time times were different Mr. back Marston, then. I strongly recommend you don't try to lose Cheap fifteen dollars. That's an that's an hour's worth of pay around yeah, here. That in mind. At least in some places. Okay, so. Yeah, we are definitely not looking so hot, so what do join Bonnie? I wonder, can I... Okay, I can look at the map. I'm wondering if we're... Does this game take place in Texas? I... 
Great Plains, tall, tall trees. Yeah, that's not fucking Rio Bravo. This could take place in Texas. I could be wrong, or I could be right, and I could just be stupid. Legends, there ain't shit on the Legends thing. I know there's probably going to be side quests and the whatnot, outfits. Oh, we get more... Oh, neat. Bonnie is the blue blip on your map. Huh. <laughs> we actually get... We get dialogue. Neat. Happy to look upon folk who can teach you various wilderness lore using these skills will unlock various challenges that can be used to that can be accomplished outside narrative missions and tasks. Performing tricks of gunmanship, hunting and skinning animals, harvesting herbs, and finding hidden treasures all play a role in surviving outside civilization. There are rewards for each rank of a challenge and a special reward for becoming a legend of each type of lore. If you manage to master all of these, you will be named a Legend of the West. Okay, so a little si stats. Um, <laughs> my honor is that of a drifter. And, okay, so I've been playing for about 17 minutes. That's fine. Okay, so where the bloody hell is the girl? Because, yeah, I'm thinking that's what we gotta do. And I'll start getting into all the small talk and fun stuff like that maybe in the next episode. Because I do, I definitely do have some things I want to say that I'll admit I kind of forgot to. Okay, so there she is. Mr. Marston, back in the land of the living, I see. Yep, I've, I've been here. Figured it's about time I started paying back that $15. <laughs> that $15. I sure can use an extra pair of hands around here. Let's see if we can get you back in the saddle. So, before we go... <laughs> Well, careful, don't fucking trip over me. B to focus on important people, places, and events. So, like, if I were to turn that way, then yeah, I'd, I'd focus There's on her. Office. It's also where we lock up good-for-nothing outlaws, such as yourself. Yeah. I'm happy enough with my current quarters right now, Miss McFarland. I yeah, so am I. Oh yeah, we get a new horse, because I'm thinking either the other one died or or ran off. So I feel like I feel like this opening stuff is gonna be a little more slow going. It certainly feels that way anyways. It's like 20, 20 minutes of doing nothing. is the general store. You won't find Parisian high fashion, but it's good for the essentials. Yeah, it's good for what we need. Very convenient. I don't think I've ever seen a ranch with its own store before. I don't like I don't like looking at the stuff the because this one's for the horses. What do you think? I'm no expert, but it certainly looks like a fine corral. I suspect you've stolen more horses than you <laughs> Now where'd you get such an idea? Gee. First impressions are hard to erase. I mean, how exactly is she going to know what we... I mean, all, all she knows That's us by is us being stupid. They sure have changed since the line finally got finished. Bringing in all sorts of new folk like yourself. Yep. Is that such a bad thing? Change is only good when it makes things better. That's actually some pretty good words to live by. But yeah, so this railway got completed, so we're definitely somewhere in the 1800s. Just have no idea where. That's the barn over there. Paul built it himself when I was just a little girl. But yeah, no, I'm not gonna look yeah. at the, I'm not gonna look at the fucking barn. I hate. And here we are, back at the house. Let's stop for a while before we head out on patrol. You'll get no complaints from me, Miss McFarland. Yeah, let's take a break and park the horse and then do nothing. It's a whole lot of nothing. And I don't know what that 6 of 18 was down there. I'll have... Are we going inside? I don't know. You tell me. I'm just... I'm following you. I'm doing whatever you want me to because I don't have a choice. I'm thinking at least the first couple of videos are probably going to be stuff like this. <sighs> 
How about a cold drink, Mr. Monster? I wouldn't know, because, again, I've never played this game. I know Shot Red Dead 2 has she's already come out. out. <laughs> I could use a rest. Sure. Come on in. I'll show you the house, and then you can sit for a while. Thank you. Yeah, I don't even know why you fixed me up. I mean, who am I to you exactly, other than nobody? Mr. Marston. Ms. McFarland. Uh, I was not The trouble we've been having with rustlers and other undesirables. I do. Will you help me keep watch on the property line this evening? Sure. I get to I shoot see some. Just who is trespassing on our land? I get to shoot it. This is a fine weapon. Come, let's head out. The country is really beautiful at around this time. Yeah, except for the uh, cattle rustlers, of course. We best get moving. This is a dangerous time of night for us. So we're gonna patrol the area and look for some cattle rustlers. Well, give me my horse, my chewing tobacco. We going on a shooting spree. Yeah, I get to shoot a paw. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't know where that came from. I think it's because this game is so slow in the beginning. Even Dragon Ball wasn't wasn't that bad. Cause fuck, I haven't gotten to shoot one thing yet. At least in Dragon Ball, I had my first fight about five minutes in. I feel a lot happier now. I got a rifle. Well, so do I. Trigger it, and my feminine intuition. We should make quite a team. With your feminine intuition and my yeah, no, it's gonna be my trigger finger that does the work. Well, you'll probably shoot them, too. I don't know. I don't even know who it's gonna... Be. It's just gonna be some guys. Look, those damn rabbits are at the crops again. Get down and give me a hand, will you? Yep. So, we're gonna shoot rabbits first. Hey. Oh, damn it. Oh, it's... Get your rifle out. It's about time these little things met their maker. Well, then, how do I pull the... Oh, well, LT2, ah. There we go. Kill those little varmints, not the bunny rabbits! Oh, and I can, I can snap it to the target. That's actually really useful. Wait. I probably killed all of one rabbit. Not the rabbits. You told me we were killing fucking horse wrestlers, not not goddamn rabbits. Oh, and we can shoot on the back of the horse. That is, I had a feeling we could. Whoop! We should keep moving. You know the There's sad thing is, I didn't even go. press anything. The horse kind of just did what it did whatever it wanted. Yeah. I, I mean, if that's. It's not the rustlers stealing our cattle. It's the rabbits stealing our crops. It ain't never easy living off the land like this. Maybe you Become a lady of leisure city. out in the big a lady city. Now nah, we gotta shoot us some varmints. Is that a coyote? Get those pets before they scare oh, the livestock. Oh shit! Oh, before there. they scare the before they scare the livestock. Yeah, that's a problem. Press LT and press so R stick into. Well. Problem is, those fuckers keep running far away. There we go. Now we're now we're cooking. I feel like I'm about to crash into this building here, and to be honest, that was actually a pretty lucky break. I do like I do like Dead Eye mode. I'm not gonna lie. Whoops. That is a bit of a problem, though. He snagged the chicken. Not the chicken. Tell me about the rabbits, George. Well, at least I I think I did a pretty good job there. Let's go. It's a good way to. Uh... Oh crap. Okay, good. Well, I returned to her. What are we doing now? Following. Okay. Following. Here we go. Okay, see now, what's that 1 of 55? Because you don't really tell me what it is per se. I'll 
Also, does my gun have unlimited ammo to it? Ding do ding do ding do ding do ding do ding 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 Oh, and does, I guess my meter doesn't fill back up on it. Oh, so you're going to... It will return to the hitching post outside your house. Neat. That is actually really good to know. Although that means if I get separated from my horse, then that means it's just going to end up... I'm kind of... I'm kind of happy I saved your life. By the way, why are you giving me a house? You can sleep in the bed in the room to save your game. If you sleep, you will wake up six hours later. Is that the only way I can save? Wow. You can also pick up extra ammo from the trunk in your room. Okie dokie. General stores, doctors, and the gunsmiths allow you to buy weapons, restock, and purchase potables. Oh no, I need Y to open it. Gentleman's attire completed, entry completed, got some ammo, can't really do much else. Change outfits. Yeah, I want that. <laughs> yeah, I think we're going to do the next video on that one. Because I think I'm going to try and keep it to this length. Try. Keyword try. I tried that with Dragon Ball and it failed miserably a lot of the times. But no, I'm going to bring this episode to a close here, even though I'm doing this in post, or at least part of it in post anyways. Happy New Year to all you guys. Welcome to 2021. Welcome to our new Let's Play of Red Dead Redemption. And until next time, as always... Thanks for watching.